I'm about to train an AI model how to sound exactly like me. I'm about to take my own speaking, upload it to this platform, and it's gonna give me an AI voice clone. I'm then gonna be able to do things like make song covers using myself, do video voiceovers. Basically, I'm gonna be able to use AI to sound like myself without even having to speak or record my voice ever again. And I'm gonna show you guys all how to do it too. Okay, so this is gonna be pretty crazy, I can already tell. So on our website, Lullaby, we just launched our voice cloner, which is a brand new feature that we've been working on for a while now. Just head on over to the products tab and click on the voice cloner. And it's basically going to allow you to upload samples or recordings of your voice. And it'll come out with a version that lets you use that voice to basically clone and, you know, use AI to mask with other recordings. If you're familiar with the voice changer from Lullaby, this is going to be pretty similar. Uh, and the voice changer basically allows you to take any recording, upload it here, and it uses a couple of demo vocals to basically turn your voice into them. The difference here is that now we can turn, you know, different songs into my own speaking voice, which is pretty crazy. And you know what? I've always said that there's a reason I never sing in my beats. I do not think I have the voice or definitely the tone or the talent to hold any notes. Maybe this AI tool is going to solve that for me. Let's get started here. I just want to click on the voice cloner option. I'll also leave that link in the description. And from here, we just need at least 10 minutes of audio of me speaking uh, that I'm going to upload to this website. And it's going to basically create an AI model that then I can use for other use cases. All right, let's check this out. I have a couple of videos like tutorial videos where it's just me speaking that I'm going to upload. All right, let's just label this test voice. All right, and here we go. This is my first time ever cloning my voice. So I'm pretty excited for this. This is, I guess, me singing. Tell me you'll eat while we wait. Tell me you feel before you pay. That's <laughs> okay. I said in the beginning, you know, there's a reason I never sing. This honestly sounds better than I could sing on my my own. And I think it does sound like me. It does do a good job of that. Let's hear what just uh, the, the speaking voice as well. Once upon a time in a land far away, there was a small village nestled between rolling hills and a sparkling river. Basically, for context, this is the uh, just demo vocals. Once upon a time in a land far away. And then now that I upload my voice, I train the AI system. So it's going to sound like me saying that now once upon a time in a land far away that's crazy and i think that the more uh the the longer files that you have to upload i'm sure that the quality would be better i just upload like a couple of like demo ones for now like that's just a, a text to speech and then we can use ai to basically mask it into my voice i can make full-length youtube videos or voiceovers just using a script and then you know put it through this system and make it sound like me okay so now i can use my voice in the lullaby's voice changer i'm pretty excited for this here we go now we have the voice pack we have the test pack right there now i just need a song and that i can turn into my voice okay, so here's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna make a cover an ai cover of me singing the song espresso by sabrina carpenter i think this is gonna be a whole lot of fun and what i'm gonna do here is i'm gonna use just the standard lullaby separation tool i'm gonna take the vocals out of the instrumental and then use the sabrina carpenter vocals to make it sound like me using ai and then i'm gonna piece everything back together okay, i'm now going to the stem splitter i want to hit the vocal and instrumental tab and i also want to click this little gear icon here and i want to make sure that i'm doing the lead and back separation and the de-echo. I basically want a really clear, clean audio uh, file of Sabrina Carpenter's lead vocals. So let's just drag and drop that here. Okay, so here we now have the lead vocal, all the backing vocals and the instrumental. Let's just preview this real quick. Like That's the one I'm gonna take uh, and turn it into my voice using AI. But I also want these ones too, the backing vocals. So, because I definitely need some help with my own vocals and the instrumental too. And now I'm gonna go back over to the voice changer. And since I have that test pack in my account, I'm going to take the, uh, the lead vocal file and put it in here. I'm excited for this. I've never like sang over any one of my beats or sang on a track before at all. So this is like really crazy. And then I'm the even my nose, the sweet I kiss so. It's again, much better than anything that I could do. See, kiss the baby on all this family is fit so. So now, in FL Studio, cause I'm just piecing everything around, I basically have the instrumental that I split with La La Lie. And I have the backing vocals. Now he is old, 
And I'm going to layer this with my own voice as the lead vocal. It's just so exciting to create like a customized AI tool that's literally the most like myself I feel like I can get right now. And also, yeah, I just think for like voiceovers or if I need to do like a quick little tutorial video, I can totally do like a text to speech, put it on here and make it sound like me. Or especially if I'm making like a video and need to do something quick while I'm on the go, I, think I can do stuff like that. But yeah, it's just exciting. But let's uh, let's check this out here. Think about me, I've been my always the sweet I kiss so. Stay kiss sweet, me I'm all this that me is kiss so. I can't really to desperation. Okay, that is crazy. Again, that is <laughs> better than I could ever sing. Better than I could ever sound like in karaoke. This is just crazy. It's fun to play around with stuff like this in AI covers, but I also just think like, if you're like a producer making like sample packs, you can do crazy stuff with that too. I just want to quickly try out like a text-to-speech generator and then see if I can make my voice sound like that too. Let's just try on something online here. Let's just do um, example text-to-speech sounding like my voice with AI. Example text-to-speech sounding like my voice with AI. All right, let's just try that and see if I can make that sound like my voice now. Let's go back to the voice changer. I want to make sure that I am on my test pack here. Let's just try this. Example text-to-speech sounding like my voice with AI. Okay, that's pretty, pretty good. Example text to speech sounding like my voice with AI. Example text to speech sounding like my voice with AI. Yeah, like you can make like full like YouTube videos or AI covers or anything like that. Like that's crazy that now I have an AI version of my voice. I just feel like that can save me so much time. And again, like imagine if I actually uploaded like 50 minutes into the, uh, into the voice cloner here and got like a really good like recording. I'm gonna definitely have to do that. But if first impressions, this was crazy. But yeah, if you guys wanna check this out for yourself, start making AI voice clones of yourself to use however you want. Uh, I'll leave our link in the description. You guys can check that out. Hit that subscribe button if you want to see more videos like this. And uh, let us know in the comments what you think of it as well. We just launched this, been working on it for a while. I'm going to have so much fun making covers uh, of songs with my voice because, yeah, I just feel like I wish I could sing as good as AI. So I'm going to have a lot of fun with this. But thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.